Now let's go on here. A man uh, uh, from Akron, Ohio. When our cross-country unit played there, they found him. He he uh, works as a pelletizer in a tire plant. He says here he plays the bones. His name is George Gilmore. George, what what is a pelletizer? Well, Mr. Mack, the batch comes off the conveyor. I mark the time down from the back on the, on the automatic switch. Goes down to the automatic chute, empty itself, puts itself back up, and goes down to the automatic switch for reloading. It's as simple as that, huh? Yes, sir. Never realized it was that easy to make a tire. <laughs> what about the, Let's get on some. What about these bones? How'd they well, start? Mr. Mack, I uh, started with rulers in school. I bet your teacher liked that, huh? Oh, yes. As a matter of fact, she encouraged me, and I started winning prizes in school after that. And then you graduated to the regular minstrel balls. Hmm? Yeah, that's right. Uh, in the Army. Mm -hmm. uh, entertain the fellas with it? Oh, yes. Uh, General Eisenhower. No kidding. Did you, did you play for President Eisenhower? Yes, sir. Matter of fact, he applauded after I got through. I bet you did, huh? <laughs> well, uh, you want to know something? Could be that he's watching you right again. It wouldn't be a great thing if he voted for you tonight, huh? Yeah. Better get in there and pitch and see what you can do about it. Go ahead. Let's hear it. Four one hundred, or it's box one nine one, Radio City Station, right here in New York.